everybody, Ralph Havens here, and this is episode three of Psychic Warrior Secrets, and today's session came in um, with inspiration this morning. So I was doing my, um, my meditation and my Qigong and my matrix energetics and peace process and everything I do in the morning to set up the day, and I was outside, and you know, we've just moved into this house a week and a half ago or so. And there was still tons of stuff out in the backyard, just piled up that we had to go through. And, um, and you know, it rains up here in the Pacific Northwest, but it, it had been really pretty pr the whole time. And um, so no urgency to get it done. And, um, and then this morning it started to rain. So I just, um, I finished up my Qigong pretty fast and, and, um, and then just started to move stuff. And then Jen had woken up right before it started raining and something just told her, I've got to move. And she got, came downstairs and then we were a really good team. And in a matter of about an hour, we got everything organized in the house and in the, um, at least from the outside, all that stuff into the house that needed to go where it needed to go and in the basement where it needed to go and totally good. And the outside of the house now is clear and feels really good. And we've got a lot of stuff done. And so what I realized was, oh, this is how a psychic warrior it could be called a, a, it gets a lot of stuff done very fast. It could be thought of as a productivity hack. You know, how do people that are successful get a lot of stuff done in a short amount of time and seem to have a lot of free time and seem so relaxed and, um, and abundant and money and all that kind of stuff and health. And so there's something called the blackjack principle that I learned. And it's basically in Las Vegas, blackjack dealers, every four, they work for 45 minutes and then they get um, mandatory 15 minute off time. And I learned from one of my coaches recently that that's what they do. And, you know, in Vegas, it's all about money. And so why would they give their blackjack dealers 15 minutes of paid time off every single hour? And it's because they need those guys sharp. And for those 45 minutes, those guys are on, they're really on. And because of that, the, the casino makes a lot of money and then they're off. And so then they're free to check Facebook, to walk around, to get a cup of coffee, to eat some food, to just relax, to call their, their spouse, whatever they're, they want to do. And then the next 45 minutes, they're back on again. And it's a really powerful thing to do because you can imagine if Jen and I were doing our um, moving and there was all this rain starting to come down and there was all this stuff in the, the, um, the backyard that we needed to move and somebody texted her on her phone and she got a little ding and then she was answering a text. And then I was like, um, going and checking my Facebook to see who I needed to click like on or click angry face or click love on or post some sort of picture. Or, you know, I thought of something and then I Googled it. And then all of a sudden I spent the next 20 minutes on YouTube. It's like, it wouldn't have got done. Right. And the end of the day could have happened and we could have not gotten it done and stuff could have got ruined. So, so one of the secrets of all this, um, how some people seem to just get a lot of stuff done really fast and the spiritual people, you know, if you're using psychic means and um, energetic means and wizard means and psychic warrior kind of ideas to, um, to get a lot of stuff done and you want to be in presence and move from a place of spirit and, and always be in alignment with that sort of thing, that's all cool. But if you find yourself getting to the end of the day and you haven't done what you really wanted to do, the stuff that would make you happy. You know, if you wake up in the morning and you go, oh, wow, I want to do this, this, and this. And then the day comes and you didn't get them all done. You got partially got them done, but you felt busy all the time. And, but you checked Facebook all the time and you were on YouTube and then you were on your instant messenger. And, and then you, you know, you checked your text messages and you answered all, all these emails and um, you know, the inbox, your inbox is pretty much, you know, other people's problems put into your um, world. So, you know, you can schedule that kind of stuff in, you know, like emails get answered um, first thing in the morning, not first thing in the morning, after you've done your daily meditation and your inner game stuff and, and been good to yourself, then you check your, your email and get all that stuff done at one time. And then maybe at the end of the day, hour or two before bedtime, or in the end of the afternoon, end of the workday, you check your email, get everything done all at once, and then you leave it alone. You don't go right and, and, um, and just check email like every five minutes, checking email and answering somebody else's problem. 
So, because you have things that you've scheduled in. So the secret, here's the, um, the hack. The secret to this is to, if you want to get a lot of stuff done in a short amount of time and feel really good about what you accomplished and feel like you're working from spirit and getting a lot of stuff um, in the physical world done for yourself, then what I found is go through and schedule in your month and your week and your day and go, okay, here's the key things. If I do this one thing today, it's a good day. If I do these five things this week and complete them, really good day. If I have um, this done for the month, that'll be good. If this is the plan for the six months, you know, here's the things I need to get done and here's the things that'll happen each month and here's the things that'll happen each week. And when you set up your, your day, here's what I need to do for today. And if you wanna take something from that blackjack idea, then you can um, go 45 minutes on. And when you're on, you can be on. If you wanna do it like that, it can get a lot of stuff done. So there's no Facebook messenger, there's no text messaging, there's no picking up the phone. There's, it's like you have your 45 minutes, then you're done with that and you have 15 minutes to, um, to play. And it's mandatory playtime, like relax, take a walk, enjoy the day, talk to your wife or your husband, you know, check in with your kids, do whatever you wanna do. And then, and then 45 minutes, you're back on. And you know, some tasks will take 45 minutes, some might take two or three, some might take the whole day, but it's a really cool way so that at the end of the day, you feel really good, you feel really good. And so the thing is to schedule it in. And then the other part is sometimes you just get an inspiration, you know, from God, from the universe. Like with us, it started to rain and it was like, today, right now, is the time to move this stuff. And so, so you know, there's the schedule and then there's the stuff that just comes as a direct inspiration um, from the universe or from God that says, move, do, go, now, finishes. So, so this is a, a, a really valuable session when you think of psychic warrior secrets. It's like, how do you wanna um, live? You know, so if you wanna, work hard and feel really good about what you do, this could be something you use. And then when you um, are off duty, you know, the 15 minutes every, every hour, the scheduled time off for your, your, your free time, then you're, you're fully engaged and present in that, right? So that if you're with your kids or with your spouse or doing something fun, you're not just answering emails and checking Facebook and, and doing all that, because then it's like you just get to the end of that day and it doesn't feel like you ever relaxed or had fun or did anything worthwhile. So cool ideas, I think. Let me know what you think. And I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm not sure how many of these I'm going to be doing um, called Psychic Warrior Secrets, but I'm going to be going till I feel like it's complete. And then I'm going to be um, setting it up so that we can have access to this in a very specific way and do it with a training program. Because my goal is to get people that want to really get ahead, get healthy, get happy, get whole, get abundant, feel good about themselves, make life really good for themselves and their family, to have a way to use magic, to use spirit, to use psychic energy um, manifestation principles, to be a wizard, to be a psychic, psychic warrior, to do it in a way that's magical and to see real results in the physical world. So that's my goal with this. Let me know what you would like with this. What would be, what would help you get ahead, get ahead in the world and use energetic means and spiritual means and other things, whatever you feel you need. Let me know in the comments. I'm going to be doing this on a schedule. I have it all written out, but also on inspiration. So I hope this finds you well. Let me know what you think. Let me know how it goes. Let me know how this feels to you. And, um, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye now.